I'm Evan. What's, what's, what's this place? <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> You're at Harrison Surf Shop. Oh. Harrison Surf Shop. I'm Ryder. I uh, hear crickets, I hear birds, and I hear Bart. Bart and my father yelling at future windsurfing pioneers in the water right now. And I'm here with the AK Compact Wingboard. What you got? This is the Cabrina Code Wingboard. And I think we just agreed that these are probably the two boards in the market that are the shortest given the amount of volume they have. Yeah. I think most other brands that are, say, around 100 liters, this is 98, that's what, 105? Uh, 105. Are going to be quite a bit longer than both of these. Yeah. So comparing the two shortest, most packable volume boards, um, start with the arrow. Start with yours. Yeah. So obviously, this board looks beautiful. I feel like, you know, I mean, it's, it's, it's red and white. And well, it's red and white. Almost patriotic here. It's, I mean, I use carbon and negra, so you see like the actual carbon on the rails. The corduroy deck is super nice and just like, yeah, has a really good feel to it. It's, um, yeah, the graph's really nice. This board definitely has a lot of volume for the size. Uh, when we were looking at the dimensions, comparing them, the the width on this board is basically how they how they sneak in the extra. This is what 98, yep. and this is 105. Is kind of how they sneak in that extra seven liters into it. So yours is actually, I think, what two inches shorter. You're five two. Yeah. So you're five two 105, and I'm five four 98. Yeah. So you're a little bit shorter, a bit wider, and a little more volume. Yeah. Where this board is just slightly longer. Slight, ever so slightly less volume and a bit narrower. Yeah. So. So yeah, bottom contours on this. Um, yeah, it's got it's got a bit of a double in it. Um, nothing crazy in the start, and then it's got the kick in the back, and uh, yeah, big chimed rails. And then what you got over there? I mean, yeah, I think both these boards are really very similar looking. Right? Yeah. Now this one's one. just slightly less wide. Than that, rush, yeah. Which I think, obviously, more width is gonna be a little more stable when you're standing on the water. You haven't stood up yet. Narrower is probably a bit better once you're up on foil and you're turning. You're not gonna catch that rail as easily. For sure. Um, that one's two inches shorter at five two. This one's five four, just slightly longer. Yeah, you got I the think, you got the you know, cutouts down here. Yeah. Yeah. Bottom shape were very similar, right? Like square or outline shape. Yeah. Nice straight rail line. Which yeah. Makes it, very fast and efficient through the water when you're just trying to ride and get up on foil. Yeah. When you touch down, it's not going to stick. We've got some little cutouts here back on the back just to kind of help with that release. Yeah. We both have kind of the big tail cutout that yeah. way you can kind of rock the tail back. I think these just add a little bit extra release when you're bumping off the water. Yeah. Um, you know, they're really, I think, very two of the most similar boards in the market. Um, they both have a corduroy deck pad. I yeah. think the, this one's definitely just a little bit thicker. Yeah. And definitely a little bit softer and smoother. Yeah. This fair enough. This one's a little bit. Um, a little rougher. A little rougher. It's a little rougher. How about, how about how's the weight? How's the weight on these puppies? I, I don't know actually. I, I think in general. So without picking that one up. Yeah. I know this board's light. It's super light. It's yeah. Light compared to the rest of the market. Where we'll do a little switcheroo. The unofficial. Grab that one. Wait, what are you? Okay. Scale. Are you like? Are you, I don't know. You tell me which uh, one. This, which, one's, this one's definitely lighter. That one's definitely lighter. I think so. I think they're pretty. They're pretty or close. maybe they're close. They're it's pretty, just, they're it's just where the handle is pretty, set on this pretty, one. They're pretty close. Not significant. No, it's pretty. That's yeah, pretty close. But I think this. I think the code's a little bit lighter. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so but we'll go. We'll, I go, we'll go comparable. I would wager to say the construction on this, I think, is hardier. In the code, I could I could believe that I could believe that is going to be a that is the car is that the carbon rails carbon negra full the full the full deck and everything is wrapped carbon negra so the color is basically overlaid on top but the full thing is yep it's completely wrapped yeah well we've got like the bamboo deck for a little yep. extra you know cushion little cushion and, yeah and carbon's dent. definitely a bit stiffer and dent resistance yeah um, price wise probably in the description because I don't know that one <laughs> off the top of my head. This this one varies a little bit size to size. Yeah. I think we're probably looking at about fifteen hundred to sixteen hundred dollars in that range, maybe up to seventeen hundred dollars for some of those bigger sizes. Yeah. You know, this is available from a four eight fifty eight liter all the way up to a five eight one eight liter. So a lot of size options. Mm -hmm. 
I've and this no one, idea. this one starts off smaller. I think, I think the smaller one, like, I think the smallest one is a four eight or four. Even the four eight, I think, is like seventy eight liters, and then it goes up to. I can't remember the biggest one, but it was the bigger one's like hundred and forty liters, and still like under five six. So there's quite a few size options for this guy as well. I think I think this guy is a little higher price point than the code, from what I remember. Not a, not a major amount, but like a little bit higher. And that's probably a function of the construction of the carbon, yeah. And um, yeah, hopefully we get some shots of us riding these boards back to back. That'd be that'd be great. And yep. uh, what else? I think that's I think that's pretty much pretty much it. Yeah, no, I think I think it's just interesting because there's two. Um, there's a lot of wing boards out there in the market, right? And I think these are two very similar takes on the same concept, which is let's put as much volume as possible into the shortest board as possible. It's definitely obvious that the code is a little bit narrower. It well, especially when we're like looking down like this, pick it. The the nose, the nose of the uh, compact is also like substantially wider. So this is almost like a. So, it, the nose is actually wider than the tail. And I actually. think we were looking at it earlier. This board is 29 and a half inches wide. Yeah. This one is 27 Seven. inches wide. Yeah. So this board is the same width as the next size up in this board. So the one, yeah. So the 118 code is uh, 29 and a half inches wide, which okay. is the same width as that one. Yeah. So that's, that is a wider version. That's you know if you're gonna go a little shorter, you're gonna have to put that volume in somewhere. Yeah, exactly. You have to add it. Well, that seems pretty good. Uh, let's. Uh, on to the next thing from uh, Hatterson Surf Shop. Thank you, Evan. Really appreciate it on this lovely day.